Hey, and welcome to MyCI, the new customer support portal for Central Innovation customers. Today, I'm going to give you a quick walkthrough of our site to get you up and running as soon as possible. Now, to log into the site, you'll need an email and password. You should have been sent an email link with some instructions to follow to set your password for the site. Once you've done this, you can come back and you can log in with your email and the password you just generated. There is also a stay signed in button if that's something you would like to do or forgot password for if you're having any other login issues or you would like to or you have generally forgotten your password. So when we log in, you'll get taken to our welcome back page. This highlights some of the important information or links on the website. So for example, we have our little hello box over here, which has some quick links for support, for contact billing information, etc. We have our tip of the week, and we have any videos that we may want to highlight for you. So this one is why choose central innovation, but we might have a new product launch or something similar. Moving down on our menu to the left, we also have um, the My Knowledge Base. Now, if you click on this, this will open a new tab and take you to our regular Central Innovation website, where you can view a lot of our SolarWorks resources. So our tips and tricks, webinars, any events, etc, etc. Next, we can move down into the subscription benefits. Now here we've got a range of SolarWorks resources, tips, videos, and our webinar calendar. So if I look down here as an example, I can, you can see our Wildman profiles. So you can see a range of Wildman profiles with the little download now button. If there are anything in here that you may want to download to help you um, with your SolarWorks. We also have for download some drawing sheets, blocks, standard library features, and 3D models. Aside from the SolarWorks resources, we also have tips. So you can see here that we have our tip of the week. We release, release a new tip of the week every week. You can search these tips using the search box, or you can click on the view tip button. We also have our videos, um, including all of our webinars. So. You can, again, like the tips, you can click on the view video button to view these webinars, which will open a new little page where you can see the video. You can play directly from here, and you can also full screen from here, or if you would prefer, you can also click on the title of the video, and this will open a new tab with YouTube if that is where you would prefer to view it. We also have our webinar calendar. So if you click on the link, it will open a new tab in your browser and take you to GoToStage, which is our webinar platform, where you'll be able to see all of our upcoming webinars and you can click and register for these. Next down on our menu is My Account. You can look at your own details here. Um, for example, you've got your, your name and your email and this is also where you can reset your password. You can also click this show help button, which will put little gray boxes with any helpful information that might help you navigate around the site as well. Next down is company. Now this will show your company details. You cannot change these, but you can view them and you can contact your account manager if there's any details in there that you would like amended. And then we also have people. This will list all of the people that we currently have on file working for your company. They'll have their name, email, when they've last logged in, and if you're the admin, you'll be able to send invites and see if they've been invited to the platform or not. Lastly, we have My Support. From here, you can see all of the support tickets that your company has raised, not just ones that you have done. You can easily raise a new support ticket by filling in the fields here on the, on the right, and you can upload any files that you may need to help us solve your issue and work on your problem. We understand that SolarWorks files and assemblies can, also, can often be quite large, um, especially if you're also doing an RX capture. 
Because of this, we've also generated and got a separate link over here, where if your files are larger than 20 megabytes, you can upload them for us. You can view the status of all the cases that are currently active in your company, and you can view the details of those. So if I have a look at this ticket here, you can see um, all the messaging backwards and forwards between the person who raised the case and the person looking after it. And you can also add any extra comments or files if you needed to as well to assist with helping solve the issue. So that is the basics of MyCR. If you have any issues, questions or queries, you can either contact us on our support line or through the New Zealand or Australian support emails.